Hello everyone and welcome in a new video today I will show you how to use a keylogger to create a server and by using that server you are able to get the saved passwords on any PC so to do that we need this PHP logger and uh, this program which is called iStealer uh, so uh, first I have to say that this program will be detected as a virus because this program will create our uh, virus to, to uh, get passwords but not any virus it will be your own virus and then you will send it to uh, the victims so to start uh, we go to uh, serversfree.com to create a server you can use 000webhost.com or any other host website so you can sign up from here or uh, sign in if you have an account so let's sign in So login, we go to control panel and this one from the last uh, tutorial so we create a new website and we go to select and from here you choose uh, the domain name or the subdomain name for example I'll choose uh, TB tutorials one password uh, for example, I don't know TB tutorials password again and captcha and we go to create. Great, now let's refresh this page. And this is our new website if you can see it it's not ready yet so anyway let's go to switch and scroll down till we find my SQL database so let's open it and from here you will create a database to get all the passwords so first you have to give a name for your database for example I will name it uh, root and the MySQL username admin password for example TB tutorials and again TB tutorials it's so easy we go to create so this is our new database uh, we need these informations now so uh, let's back and we go to PHP logger PHP logger again and we open this file using notepad great now we have to fill these informations I will show you how to do it so first copy uh, the MySQL host so just copy it and back to this file and paste it right here great now let's back again and we go to mysql user so let's copy it and we paste it here right in front db user and finally we copy mysql database and we paste it here so database password it's the password that we choose here so i think i type tb tutorials as the password and finally you have to choose a username and a password to get to the passwords page for example again i will use tb tutorials but you can choose anything you want and password i'll choose also tb tutorials so we go to file and save and now we are done now we need to upload this page to our website to do that we go to file manager which is here so we go to install so let's go to view result and now we have to wait some time till our website get ready i think it will take some minutes so we'll back later 
so we are back and now as you can see here our website is ready so we can access to the file manager we click on open file manager so from here we have to delete this file so right click and we go to delete remove and we go to upload files and upload our files which are this folder so we go to uh, php logger php logger and these are our two files that we just edited so we go to open and as you can see here our file is uploading so let's close it and let's refresh our website as you can see here this is our page so we have to uh, log in to get the passwords page so I think I type TB tutorials as a username and TB tutorials also as a password and log in. so our page is ready now we have to create a server to do that we back and we open iceder and right click and run as administrator so yes and this is our program i will explain a little bit this program so in the first one here you have to put your uh, website url and from here you can uh, bind your server with any file you want uh, with an image or song wherever you want you can uh, hide your file in uh, that uh, song or picture and here you can choose an icon I will upload these icons so you can choose between it icon pack and finally here you choose the path for the file and from here you can test if the uh, server will work or not and options from here you have the uh, programs that uh, this program can hack really interesting programs like filezilla google chrome opera and many firefox internet explorer and many other programs so this is great now let's build our server so we go to close and first we have to put our website which is this one so let's copy it and paste it here and let's keep index so let's just delete the first part and paste here so paste great now if you want you can bin the file with an image or mp3 file or a video whatever you want you can choose an icon from here for example I'll choose anyone for example this one and we go to build first let's test it so as you can see work perfectly so we go to build and for example I'll build it on in the desktop and I will name it test one and save build correctly now let's close now I will be the victim and I will make a double click on this file so double click and that's all what you need to hack a victim so let's refresh this page and as you can see here you got all my saved passwords you have here on Opera on FileZilla with FileZilla you can hack my email you can hack my Facebook that I typed using Opera or even Google Chrome so you see our server is working now but the problem is that this server now is detectable by any antivirus and in the next tutorial I'll show you 
how to make this file not discovered by any antivirus so you can see the video on the top right of the screen you can click on it and learn how to uh, encrypt your file that's all for today thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe and to share this video if you if you appreciate it thanks again and goodbye